Hello there, welcome to Bobo's Fishing Adventures. As you can see, it's glorious. It's the heat wave, second day of it, and I have to say, it is very, very still, muggy, stodgy. Fingers crossed we'll get some fish tonight. Well, we're doing hill head again tonight, just myself. Tried to get some fresh bait on the, on the way out tried quite a few sort of like spots for the old mackerel but just they just weren't having it I was trying to find birds that were working but nothing at all no idea. we've still got plenty of mackerel we've got plenty of squid um, got some worm as well that's what I've literally just done the first drop here and I've had a couple of rat rattles on this one uh, one more block. 16 oh there we go uh, 16 16 feet of water, very very clear, a little bit of weed going through, not enough to like, ruin the, the fishing at the moment, but as I say it's first drop and I know I've tried some feathering and that and there is a little bit of the green weed about, but yeah well all we can do is hope, um, I'm hoping as soon as the old sun goes down, sort of like around 9 o'clock ish, hopefully I'll get the bass come on the feed, I'd say in the last session I had quite a good uh, few bass, I think it was nine bass, uh, only one undersized, all the rest were sort of like averaging four or five pounds, so that was good, and I had some nice form backs as well, so I would like to think uh, that'll happen again this evening, so through the night, hopefully do all night, maybe pack up around sort of like five o'clock, first light, but we'll, we'll just see how it goes, um, giving a little bit of breeze tomorrow morning from the east, that matters. Uh, but no, what a, what a cracking evening. As I say, I'm only inshore. 16 foot of water. So yeah, let's uh, let's hopefully uh, we'll get some fish. Uh, usual rigs, uh, 4-0 and 2-0 wide gate panels for the for the bass and the uh, rays. And as I say, this one here, I've literally just put a couple of size twos on. Um, just see what's about, I had a bream last time, so that could have been the rattles I've been getting now, but we'll see, see what happens, in fact I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a bait check and uh, get it back out, and, uh, still rattling away, little we going through, but, we, uh, oh there it goes, there just as I do it, as I say, small hooks, only worm bait to start with. Just trying to kill a bit of time, to be fair, because it's it's the night and the evening. That's what I'm uh, looking for. So might get the, the decent fishing. But oh, there we go. Look, good old boy. Uh, is it on? Oh, yeah, something there. Could be a could be a small black bring. Oh, and again, go on then. What have we got? Oh, there we go. Look, first drop, small little black bream. Yeah, nice. A little bit of weed there. That's good. Get that weed off you. Come on, hold still. What a beautiful fish in that sunlight. Look at him. Dawson's up. Beautiful. A pretty little fish, and they don't have fight. Even this one, you know, big old rattles. You can virtually tell a black bream on the bottom, but no, I'm happy with that. First drop, so that's good. So, uh, fingers crossed, we'll get some other ones. Well, looks like I could have another black bream here. Could be a black bream fest for a couple of hours which I don't mind don't mind a few black bream be nice if they have a bigger size but got to be in it to win it come on oh. I miss it bit outgunned on these uh, Big up to here, but 
Hi ho. Oh, here we go. Okay, another one. That's good. Come through. Just tiny little hooks, tiny little bits of bait. Beautiful. <laughs> Smaller than the last one, I think. Look at that in that sun. Don't they look cracking? Beautiful, beautiful fish. There we go. <laughs> right, let's have a look. Just simple running ledger. Don't go too complicated. Stick to think. Easy, simple. That's the best way. As I say, little tiny hooks. Don't need massive worms. Put that down a bit, there we go. I thread them on. Put that tail off, put that on the top one. Get that one in, nothing wrong with that. Not the best presentation, but it will do for a few back brings until the evening comes. Now I always cast away from the boat, I mean I'm in 16 foot of water, but uh, I always cast away, don't keep it close to the boat, no point. Make sure you like that, a bit of weed on the surface, to be expected it's still weird. Always set your ratchet nice and light. As I say, you might be fishing for black bream, but trust me, if a 10, 12 pound bass comes along, it ain't gonna pass up a meal, whether it's a small bit of ragworm, squid, or anything. So always, always fish for prepared, so to speak. But yeah, bring it on.